Hi, I'm Dr. Audrey Tang. Now, I'm not here to fix you. As a friend, I will support you. As a psychologist, I will give you the tools for growth. As a coach, I'll help you use them to unlock your inner strength. But I will not fix you. Living is about knowing that no matter what, you have what it takes to fix yourself. I'm a chartered psychologist and author. I'm a presenter and wellbeing advocate. I'm also a people pleaser, a high achiever, neither of which are compliments, and every day I fight my own insecurities. But every day I'm winning. So what does it take? Well, it can be so many things and the more the merrier. It could be a positive attitude, friends who energize you, having a series of practices at your disposal, life skills, things such as reflection, critical thinking, methods of resolving conflict, affirmations, anything you can draw on just like that to get your life back on track. It can also be learning not to play a part in other people's psychodramas, knowing to walk away because although you can save the world, you cannot save people from themselves. And it definitely involves knowing and living your values every single day. Now, most of us know this because we've learned it through experience. It's why I reached the age of 45 and suddenly went, oh, that's what I should have done. And I know some of you, if you reach that point, you'll seek intervention. But what if you could start building those skills early, when you're not at rock bottom, when you're not fed up of people sapping your time and energy and never returning it, when you're not trying to survive, but at a time when those skills are simply a just in case. You might never need to have that midlife epiphany. You might be able to resolve some of those derailments and whilst other people are seeking to recover, you can be seeking to climb. You might be able to spend more time in a committed, contented relationship rather than, like me, hope for second chances because you've already surrounded yourself with energizing people rather than throwing time and money into energy vampires. Maybe you'd be able to focus on the fact you have a glass which is refillable rather than fighting over whether something's half full or half empty, usually with people whose opinions are unsolicited and whose advice you would never ask. Remember, it's not about any old fix, which is what we tend to look for at the point of crisis. It's about learning how to fix yourself throughout life's roller coaster. And that sort of learning shouldn't be a luxury. So here's what I do. Yes, I set fees for coaching and training, and that's because I tailor those sessions to specific requirements. I follow up, I'm available to clients for discussions or Q&A, and yes, I also sell my books, but my articles, podcasts, broadcasts, in fact, everything on my YouTube channel is free for all. The support in all of those open access forums may be more generalized, and it will certainly be tailored to topics I enjoy, or at least that I have interesting ways of demonstrating. But every single thing I suggest works. How do I know? Because I do all of them myself. And if you think I'm generally together, you know what, I agree with you. And I used to be a complete mess. Right up until four years ago, I had friends who took advantage of me. I had people who ghosted me as soon as I dared to treat them in the way that they were treating me. And really, I still have what I call my Bridget Jones moments, but because I have now got an amazing network, those friends either call them those traits endearing or they call me out on them. They help me to learn. So maybe doing everything I suggest doesn't mean the storm won't come. It may not even give you everything you need to navigate, but what it will do is it will begin to instill in you that you can learn, you can change, you can reflect, you can take control of your life and you will captain your ship and keep sailing. And you'll also get through every single day.